If I was going to describe research at UCR, I would say it's exciting, fun, international, outstanding, inspiring, innovative, open-minded, very open-minded. It's novel and it's seminal. And of course, world-class. I chose UCR for my PhD because UCR is one of the best universities in the UK and it has a very high international reputation. My research focuses on using organic waste to produce renewable energy and chemicals. It will also help to contribute to tackle some of the greatest challenges, such as climate change. The research environment at UCL allowed me to apply my own ideas, and I can have my ideas come true with the support of resources and expertise. My field is silent cinema, more specifically um, British silent cinema, and I'm looking at representations of, of women work and city space in fiction films from the 1910s and 20s. And a lot of these films are just buried down in the archives and not much has been written about them. The university interested me because it encourages cross-fertilization of academic fields through interdisciplinary research and collaborations. And it's also an excellent institution and it has very good uh, sources of funding, which is very important for PhD researchers. UCL has a large number of scholarships. I myself have availed twice UCL alumni scholarship. As far as research is concerned, UCL has world-class facilities. It's situated in Bloomsbury, right in the middle of a historical place. The location is perfect. I wanted to live in a city where I did not only want to study, but I wanted to have a social life. So I picked London because of its excellent social networking capabilities. When you're in London, you're surrounded by great consultancy agencies, um, other experts out in the world, uh, in, in the profession. It's definitely an advantage to be based in London, associated with UCL. The combination makes research work much more accessible, much more easy. You can actually tap into resources much easier. It's very important to find the right supervisor because I think PhD students have different paces and, and methods of working. The key attributes for a PhD student for me would be drive, motivation, passion, real passion, enthusiasm, someone that wants to take on a challenge, someone that's prepared to change. I've been very lucky, I've had some wonderful PhD students Quite a few of them gone on to fantastic stellar academic careers and others have gone into business. I would like to teach and there are a lot of possibilities to expand on my research so I'm re really looking forward to, to the future in that terms. <laughs>